Donetsk suffered unsafe with Russian artillery. Donetsk regional governor Pavlo Kirilenko said the cities of Slovyansk and nearby Kramatorsk have suffered heavy shelling overnight. Ukrainian defenders fought desperately to withstand a major Russian offensive in the Donetsk region, with the enemy laying down heavy artillery fire to pave the way for ground forces to advance a senior Ukrainian official said on Wednesday. After Russian forces on Sunday took control of Lyschansk, the last bastion of Ukrainian resistance in Luhansk, Ukraine's military braced for an assault on Donetsk, with the cities of Slovyansk and Kramatorsk both in the Russian line of fire. Donetsk and Luhansk comprise the Donbass, the industrialized eastern part of Ukraine that has seen the biggest battle in Europe for generations. There was heavy fighting at the edge of Luhansk region, its governor Seri Haidar told Ukrainian television, saying Russian regular army and reserve forces had been sent there in an apparent effort to cross the Seversk Donetsk River. Haidai earlier said Russian forces were engaged in widespread shelling as they launched their assault on Donetsk. Russia says it wants to wrest control of the entire Donbass from Ukraine on behalf of Moscow-backed separatists in two self-proclaimed People's Republics. Russian forces struck a market in a residential area in Slovyansk, killing at least two people and injuring seven local officials said. A Reuters reporter at the scene saw yellow smoke billowing from an auto supplies shop and flames engulfing rows of market stalls as firefighters tried to extinguish the blaze. Donetsk regional governor Pavlo Kirilenko said Slovyansk and nearby Kramatorsk has suffered heavy shelling overnight. There is no safe place without shelling in the Donetsk region. This is BBS News. Thank you for listening. Remember to subscribe to our channel. Goodbye.